This government has a pattern of breaking promises, Mr. Speaker. Two years, families have been waiting. They've been waiting a lot longer than that, but this government committed to it two years ago. They slash funding to education, Shame. and then they take credit for restoring just a portion of what they cut. There is a serious gap in services for lower-functioning children with autism over the age of six. Mr. Speaker, in 2016, the SAS party promised in its election campaign to introduce individualized funding, an improvement that other provinces are already offering. Christina's family is having to choose between the basics and autism supports. Nearly two years later, that promise has not come to fruition, and according to Christina, the proposed plan will not come close to meeting the needs of families with autism. To the Minister, when this government has already broken their promise and is lagging behind other jurisdictions, why is Saskatchewan's ultimate goal to offer less than other provinces in individualized funding? Here, here. 